Hey there YouTube, this is Octo, and today I'm going to show you how to use cheats in Ark Survival Evolve. This should work for any map, should be irrelevant, so long as you're running either a single player or a multiplayer server on Ark, you should have no problem at all. So, the first step is to press the tab button. Uh, this is on PC from Steam, so if you're using an Xbox, you'll need to actually press the left and right bumper along with the X and Y buttons simultaneously. And if you're on a PlayStation, you'll need to press L1 and R1, as well as a square and triangle simultaneously. And that will open this little bar at the bottom, uh, or it may look like this as well, an uh, entire console window. So you can just press tab to cycle through it like that. If it's in your way, just press tab to get it out of the way. And you'll notice that when it's ready, you can type in uh, commands just like this. So I'm going to type in um, enable cheats here first. Now you don't need this on a single player server like I'm on, but if you're on a multiplayer server, you may need it. So you enable cheats and you put in your password right there. So now that you have the cheats enabled, you can go ahead and type in either, uh, if you're on a single player server, directly uh, type in the command that you want to use. Or if you're on a multiplayer server, you can type in either cheat or admin cheat, depending on the cheat. They will require different kinds. So you have to preface it with admin cheat. And let's say we want to oh add experience that's always a good one so we'll type in add experience and then you know our parameters so like a thousand experience you know and then these extra numbers here decide um, who to give it to or whether or not to share with the tribe um no you don't have to remember that that's just showing you that i use that sheet and that gives me a uh, thousand experience now, since I'm on a single player server, you can see here that I'm already max level, so it doesn't matter. But on a single player server, you can just type in add experience and give yourself a thousand for nothing at all. Uh, there you go. And you can see also if I press the up button here, I can see all my previous uh, commands here. You'll see that there's some common ones like r.bloomquality equals zero. And R light shafts equals zero. This is because uh, normally the sun is very bright in the game. So if you use these two commands uh, when you log in, uh, you should be, or when you switch worlds as well, I think, you should be fine. It shouldn't blind you. As well as show my admin manager. This is very important. If you go ahead and click that, now you can see, um, let me get out of tab here. It's going to lag for a second when it opens this UI up. There we go. So now you can see all the connected players to the server, uh, some important information such as your own position, the frame rate, very detailed frame rate. You can also, arguably the most important part, use all the cheats here just by clicking it. So you can go ahead and click the player here. Uh, well, first you'll click, say, add experience. And you'll hit execute. And well, first you gotta click that and then click the player, make sure they're selected, and then hit execute. So you copy player ID, I believe. And since here you just type in 1000, hit execute, and that should work. Uh, maybe that's not the exact way you use that one particular command from the uh, admin menu. But go ahead and test with it and see how that works. There's things such as uh, allowing players to your whitelist if you have a whitelist for your server. Uh, banning players, very important. Broadcasting a message. Here you could just type in, say, broadcast. And you'll get a broadcast message to the entire server. You can clear a player's inventory. You can get rid of their tutorials, destroy all their players, dinos, and structures just by looking at them. You can look at something with destroy my target and get rid of it. You could restart the level. You could force a tame on a feature. You could mm, give yourself all the tribe structures or all the engrams in the game. Boom. See? Um, 
some of these will require say give engram you'll have to put in a player ID or something like that uh, you, you on a multiplayer server you can click here and then click execute and then copy the player ID or the steam ID as you need it depending on the command and also here you can click their name and send a message as well hey um, there you go probably doesn't send any message because it's a single player server but I assume on a multiplayer server it'll work you've got your different pieces here um, your band players your whitelisted players um, these will show numbers instead of names those are the steam IDs I believe for the individual player so you'll have to get that from the steam profiles you go to the profile and look at the end of the URL they'll have a unique ID if they have a name at the end of that URL, you'll have to convert it on like a Steam ID converter. You can Google that. And finally, we've got the broadcast command here as an easy sort of message of the day thing. So whenever someone logs in, they get, hey, this is the message of the day. There you go. Refresh the message. Boom, good to go. Excellent. So you can close that out. Sometimes you'll on a command, you'll have to look directly at the target. So we'll go into... Uh, I'll get the first person again. Oh, wow. There we go. If you look directly at the target and then use the command, say force tame or admin chief force tame, you just click that and it'll do it as if you were shooting a gun at it or like using your mind to shoot a, a path directly at that creature. If it's not in your targets, it won't work. So keep that in mind. And that's about it for using cheats on ARC. It's pretty simple. You can also check out um, the Gamepedia wiki page. Uh, that'll have a lot of the commands on it that is just straight up listed out. You can also check my Steam guide, which will go over a few more, or my YouTube channel, which has uh, command examples such as Force Tame, uh, you know, giving items, any item you want of any quality, a little guide for that, and so forth. Alright, I hope you enjoyed it. Have a good one.